Hey, you got a minute? Great, because it's One Minute Wednesday, and have we got a cash for you. Yeah, this is one of the newest things people are looking for, and not even in geocaching. So let's go. One cash. One minute. Cue the title. Start the clock. Go. <laughs> wow. I think we found it. He's even got a little tie for his hair. That's a really cool troll, eh? Yeah. Second one, that's awesome. But aren't we supposed to be finding a cache? Oh yeah, we better go get it. And we got it in three, two, one. Done. <laughs> An old phone. <laughs> That's funny. Well, this is the end. Yep, that's it. And another troll logged. And this is a cool feature for you to get. There's a there's an awesome uh, attribute that you can get from one of these trolls. And it's the latest thing. It's really cool. A lot of people are finding them. It's an awesome art installation. Keep watching. There's more caches to be found. Where will geocaching take you? This geocache has the attribute partnership cache. That's one of only a select few that you can find in the world. At one point, it was down to just nine geocaches, and we've been finding those in our travels. We found one in Nashville, and we found one in Minnesota or Wisconsin. There is one in Seattle. There's one in New York City as well. And there are a few in Europe. But now, with the introduction of this series of troll statues, the partnership cache attribute is expanding. And now, it's up to something like 20. So look up attributes, and you can see how many you have. And it's something that you can go after in your geocaching goals. It has so many attributes that you can get. Once you've been geocaching for a while, you'll have quite a few. Okay, go that way. That is so cool. I'm surprised a bird hasn't built a nest up his nose yet.